Hi, welcome back uh, to CVN305. Um, I'm just going to talk to you briefly about bending. Up to now, we talked about torsion. Remember, torsion was axial twist, like that, right? So we twisted it like that, and in the end view, it looks, you know, uh, roughly, you know, I'm twisting it like that, right? Bending is transverse twist. What do I mean? Transverse rotation. What do I mean by that? I'm holding it like this. Look at the two pencils. That's what I wanted to focus our attention on. Can you see how it gets to be twist to be bent? It, it becomes a transverse rotation of the cross section. Each cross section rotates in a transverse way. This is bending. And the cause of bending is bending moments. So if I use my right hand thumb rule, can you see which way the things are positive? So this is positive, that's positive. Okay, so on this end, rotating this way is positive. On this end, rotating that way is positive. Basically speaking, what should happen is it should take my beam, which is a straight beam, and convert it into a cup-like shape. That's how it works. Okay, so once we get that idea, the question is, I want to be able to relate how what happens to it. First thing I want you to notice is that, look at the rectangles. When I bend it upwards, like that, can you see that the rectangles shrink? That is, it gets smaller this way, right? It gets squeezed because I'm squeezing it on top. Um, uh, alternately, if I bend it the other way, can you see it gets extended? So I'm extending it. So what happens with bending is that the cross section, one part of the cross section gets squeezed, that part of the cross section gets squeezed, the opposite end gets uh, extended. That's what happens in bending. So bending is transverse movement of the rotation of cross sections. So, so just to get you an idea, the four principal modes of deformation of a beam are extension, which means I'm pulling, Right, like that, and it's very difficult to pull. Right, the other one is sliding, sideways movement of the cross section. Then the third one is torsion, rotate, axial rotation of cross section. And the fourth one is bending, transverse rotation of cross section. So, what are the four things? So, this is the most important idea. So, the first one, the first one is extension. Second one is transverse shear, that means sideways movement. So extension means axial movement of cross section, sideways movement of cross section, axial twist of cross section, that's the third one. So third one is axial twist and the fourth one is bending. Okay, thank you.